Hi, welcome to my channel. This is Kausal Vice and this is the continuation video of depreciation accounting. Please see the description box to get the link for the entire collection. Now in this video, we are going to see the next method that is a revaluation method. Now let's get into the video. See, this method that is revaluation method is applicable for assets like bottles, packages, copyrights, patents, loose tools, etc. Okay, so such kind of assets, revaluation method is the best method to find out the depreciation. Here, the depreciation value is calculated based on the difference between book value in the beginning and book value of the end of the year. Every year they revise the value of assets. If they find any difference between beginning value and end value, the difference is called depreciation. Okay, see the problem. On 1st January 2018, X Limited had a stock of loose tools valued at 16,000. On 1st July 2018, they purchased additional tools which amounted to rupees 10,000. The tools were independently valued at the end of each year and the values placed on them were as under. At the end of the first year, that is 2018, 25,000. End of 19, 24,100. At the end of 2020, 23,500. At the end of 2021, 23,000. They have given the book value at the end of each year. Okay. With this information, they are asking you to find out the amount of depreciation and show the loose tools account from 2018 to 2021. Okay. Now, let's see the solution. See the solution. According to revaluation method, we are going to prepare the asset account. Loose tools account, debit side, credit side, date particulars amount, date particulars amount. See the problem. On 1st January 2018, X Limited had a stock of loose tools valued at 16,000. This is the opening balance. Okay. So, on 1-1-2018, two balance brought down. Opening balance how much? 16,000. On 1st July 2018, they purchased additional tools which amounted to rupees 10,000. So, additional purchase made during the year on 1st July. So, on 1st July 2018, to ban. This is the entry for purchase of loose tools. How much? 10,000 rupees. The tools were independently valued at the end of each year and the values placed on them were as under. At the end of the first year, that is 31st December 2018, what is the revised value? 25,000 that is closing balance on 31st December 2018 by balance carry down 25,000 that's all this is the closing balance now you can get the balancing figure that balancing figure is called depreciation so here 26,000 and closing value 25,000 what is the difference 1000 rupees difference that is a depreciation for the first year on 31st December 2018 by depreciation balancing figure so this is the way to calculate depreciation according to revaluation method now this will become the opening balance for the next year first January 2019 to balance brought down 25,000 this is the opening balance for the current year now see the problem for the closing balance on 31st December 2019, closing balance how much? 24,100. So, credit side, 31st December 19, by balance, carry down, closing balance, 24,100. Opening balance, 25,000. Closing balance, 2,400. What is the difference? 900 difference. So, this is depreciation on the same day. By depreciation. This is the balancing figure. Okay. Now, this will be the opening balance for the next year. Get the total. $25,000, Now, this closing balance will be the opening balance for the next year. $24,100. Okay. On 1-1-2020, two balance brought down $24,100. See the problem? Next year on 2020, 
23,500. This is the revised value, closing balance. 31,12,2020 by balance carried down 23,500. Get the total 24,100. 24,100. Balancing figure 600. 31st December 2020 by depreciation balancing figure 600. Okay, next year. this will be the opening balance for the next year. 1 1 2021 to balance brought down 23500. See the problem on 31st December 2021. How much closing balance? 23000. 2021 by balance carried on closing balance 23,000 get the total 23,500 23,500 balancing figure 500 by depreciation balancing figure okay so this will become the opening balance for the next year 1 1 2022 to balance brought down 23,000 that's all okay see the problem they have given closing balance for the four years for the four years we have prepared a loose rules account to find out the depreciation amount of depreciation so first year thousand second year 900 third year 600 fourth year 500 now the value, opening value for the next year, how much? 23,000. So, this is the way to prepare asset account according to revaluation method to find out the amount of depreciation. You can check the description box to get the link for the entire collection. Hope you like this video. Please hit the like, comment, subscribe and share with your friends. Thank you.